Today I wanted to show you guys who are using BlueStacks, especially BlueStacks 4, how to set up your controls with a wireless controller in Punching Gray Raven. Now first step, you're going to need a wireless controller for your PC. Now if you actually get into the game over here, I'm just going to close my little camera of me so you guys can get a full picture of the screen while I'm doing this. All right now, to set it up on BlueStacks 4, you're going to have to open your game controls and go to Open Advanced Editor. Now once you have the control editor open, you're going to want to go here and, and click Custom. You're going to want to grab these tap spots and put them down to each one of these spots here. Now once you set up all the tap spots, you're also going to want to put down a free look. I would usually put it on the top left corner. It's easier if you hide it in the corner because when you're practicing your controls, you're going to have these dots on the screen. You can make them invisible later once you get used to everything. Now you're going to want to grab a... Uh, a d-pad and drag it all the way down over here and try and line it up as best as you can now once you have all this set up on the screen to set up a a, a tap spot with a control so you want to go over here to gamepad for the controller uh, click the tap key section grab your wireless controller and then just type in the command that you're looking for and it's just as easy as that now i'm just going to switch over to how i have my other configuration set up to show you guys now, as you can see on my screen, this is how I have, have it set up. I find it the easiest like this with the A as the dash, the RT as my main attack button, LT for your ulti. And for up here, I have B, Y, X as the first starter three to help me kind of like understand on the controller. How do I want to sequence these? And then this is RB, RB, and then this is R3. Again, try to change it around to see what you guys like the best. But for me to try to understand and make it a little bit easier, I did the B, Y, X on top of here. Give it a go and see how it, so see how it is. You also want these up here to switch between characters. So this is how it should be once you have your controller set up and everything. Oh, I just love this character. Sadly, she won't be out till Grand Blue, guys, so that is what it is. But I feel like this is one of the best commands for me right now. Again, guys, if you found this video entertaining, helpful, or you just came to hang out, please don't feel afraid to leave a like or subscribe. That, again, that would really help the channel, and I'd really appreciate it. But until then, I can't wait for this game to come out, and I'll see you all there. And hopefully you'll have your control schemes ready. See you in the next one. Peace.